So I want you to stand with your hand on your chest and your hand on your diaphragm and take that breath. Coming from your midsection, lower rib one and two. When you are diaphragm breathing, your chest should not be involved at all. If you see your shoulders rising and lowering, we are not there yet. Also, as you're practicing learning how to diaphragm breath, my clients are able to tell when they've done two or three breaths in a row and then went up to a chest breath, they can feel it and recognize it. I want you to have that skill as well. So now let's assume you are all successful at diaphragm breathing and now we need to speak from it. So I'm going to take a breath and let's count from 1 to 15 just like what we did before. 